here with Savannah State head coach Steve Davenport. Coach Davenport just finished uh, the spring game. Talk a little bit about the entire spring practice, few weeks out here. Um, did you guys get what you wanted to accomplish? Well, our number one goal coming in OPO was to make sure we didn't survive catastrophic injuries. We uh, didn't want to have a spring where we had somebody that we're not going to have in the camp coming in the fall. So we survived that. Um, and then we wanted to compete. And we obviously every day came out here to compete to get better offense versus defense, which is typically what spring is. And, and we feel good about it. Obviously, we've got a ways to go. Uh, but you at least feel good when you got something to work with to start. And we feel good about it. Our numbers are good right now, and we feel good about the guys we got coming back. Uh, in today's game, um, offense versus defense, like you said, were you happier with one group than the other? Did the one stand out, um, or, or were they both pretty much about the same? Well, it, it, when you're the head coach and your, your other role is an offensive coordinator, you kind of uh, have that duo mentality, even when they stopped us. Somebody was doing something good that's a part of your team. Uh, but I felt good about both sides. The main thing I wanted to see was competition, and we felt like we got that. Obviously, as a coach, you always wait to watch the film, and I'm going to watch the film in an hour or so. But, but you know, just in the first thought process and the way I saw it today, I feel really good about it. Well, like you said, competition, one of the um, key positions, always at the quarterback. Seems like uh, in this game, Bostic seemed to have the edge. He seemed real comfortable um, in the pocket, did some good things. Uh, did Bostic stand out over the other guys today? I thought Bostic stood out over, over the other guys in spring. He'll, he'll leave spring the number one guy, but you know, that doesn't mean the competition's over. And then we've got a, a junior college kid that we signed, Zach Hutchison, that's going to join the free of competition. So we've got a long way to go, but obviously he established himself, and he's a senior. I mean, that's no different than what you'd expect, but he's got to know he's got to work and get better every day to hold on to the job. And then that's what we want at every position. We want everybody, every guy to come out here and feel like they've got to compete every day mm -hmm. to get a chance to play. And uh, right now he's feeling good about it. Well, today was the uh, end of the spring game. Your, your, your next game, Georgia Southern. Um, do the fans of Savannah have something to look forward to? Or, uh, are you guys looking forward to the upcoming fall season? Well, absolutely. I mean, when you're a ball player, you can't wait to be able to go and do it in front of people. And that's what I talked to them about pre-spring pre game. Hey, man, we got some people coming to see you, and that's why you work hard. Um, and, and Statesboro's right up the street. It's our closest rival. Um, it, it'll be a tremendous test. Uh, Coach Monken does a, a great job with his program up there, but, but we're excited about it. Uh, we'll be ready to go and compete with those guys. And, and that, once again, it gives you a parameter of where you are. Win, lose, or draw, you'll get an idea of where you are as a program. And if it doesn't turn out well, we know we got more work to do. And if it turns out well, we'll celebrate and party for that, that night. All right, well, thanks, Coach Doug. All right, brother. All right, boss, you just finished the spring game. Talk a little bit about the whole spring practice, um, what you went into it, looking to get out of it, and if you accomplished some of those things. Uh, in the spring practice, we came out, you know, we, uh, we had a new system. Well, not a new system, but we had some couple plays that we needed to learn, some new plays that we needed to learn. And uh, we got that down. We was a little rough when we started off, but uh, we stuck together and, you know, we watched film and we got that on the board and put it all on the field. Well, you look like you um, pretty poised out here today. You went five for ten um, when it came down to the spring game portion of it. Um, had one touchdown. Talk about it. Did you feel good out here? It seemed like you had good chemistry with the receivers. It felt really good. Uh, I know uh, I can revert back to uh, we had hitch right before uh, right before we started scrimmage in uh, skill seven on seven. Uh, me and Simon was on the same page, uh, but uh, I was thinking something else. He was thinking something else. But uh, you know, overall, uh, I think we did pretty good. I think. Well, good, man. It, it looks like you improving your blocking a little bit through a good block, freed him up um, when it didn't go for the touchdown, but it was pretty good uh, pass and play. Yeah, yeah. I, I didn't know he was at, uh, behind me at the moment, but uh, when I looked back and I, I saw him, uh, yeah, broke. Uh, you know, just do whatever I can do to help my team win and uh, throw that block. And uh, everybody was excited about that. See a quarter throw block. All right, man. Thanks, man. <laughs> All right, thank you. Got wide receiver Simon Haywood. Simon, um, just finished the spring break game. Talk a little bit about the entire spring football uh, practice experience. You know, you guys came in, been out here for a few weeks now. Did you get some things that you wanted to get accomplished? Uh, yeah, you know, as a team, uh, we want to uh, come together as a group. You know, uh, last year, uh, around the end of the season, well, the start of the beginning of the season, we weren't together as a group. We had different groups inside the team, and we weren't together. This spring, we worked on bonding. Like last night, you know, we uh, we had a cookout for the team. It was a nice event, and it showed that we could, we becoming a team. We coming together. Um, you led the, the team last year in uh, receiving. Seems like you're the only one who came out here and caught a touchdown this game. Um, was that one of the goals that you uh, set for yourself? Uh, the goal for the spring game, I told I, I told coach I was gonna come out here and. Uh, 
get them for at least 100 yards. But uh, you see, obviously, I ain't get 100 yards today. But uh, as an offense on the whole, we did, we did pretty good. Good. Well, thank you. I appreciate it. All right. All right, man. <sighs>